Hello, I'm Ken from KBD Productions TV and welcome back to another Ken Domic food review just for you. I've been asked many, many times to do the Farmhouse King, and now that I got the chance to zip over to Niagara Falls, New York, and visit a Burger King, now is the time to try this Farmhouse King that you guys have been asking me for for quite some time. Uh, it's a limited time offer, and I still am working on my Arby's drink that I bought two reviews ago. I have to shoot all three videos in the same day. After this, I'm heading home and gonna put myself into a small coma. All right, let's get into this thing. So just the burger all by itself is 7.09. After taxes, it came to 7.66. I will not be eating this whole item. Just to give you a little full disclosure here, I've just eaten way too much already. I should have asked each one of the places to cut it in half, but the Arby's thing was just too good. Let's compare this one to the one I found on the internet. Ding! This one looks way taller, I bet, and way better. All right, guys, let's go in for a close-up. And we'll start off with this sesame seed toasted bun. Then you got two quarter pound flame grilled beef patties, thick cut bacon, two slices of American cheese, crispy onions, ketchup, creamy signature sauce, and a fried egg. Let's take a bite out of this farmhouse king. But before we do, I just want to say something. I noticed that the egg is, the yolk is hard as opposed to runny. And I prefer a runny, like a sunny side egg on my burgers, the burgers I've had in the past. And I accidentally tasted a little bit of this sauce that came off and it's really sweet. I'm not sure if I'm gonna like the sauce on this with egg. Anyway, let's take a bite. Like I said, disclosure, I'm not bite, I'm not eating this whole thing. Mm-hmm. Typical Whopper patty taste to it. The cheese is all right, but again, that sauce is kind of giving me a little bit of the willies, as you can say, maybe. Let's take another bite just to make sure we're gonna judge this properly. Thank you, Arby's. All right, guys, I'm gonna judge this right now. I am gonna tap out. I'm not gonna eat any more of this. Uh, the burger itself, I don't know, it's, it's dry. Even though they have the sauce on there, it's still dry from the two patties. And, and again, this hard egg that's in there. Uh, again, I didn't get very far into it, but the first two bites was just all meat patty and egg and a little bit of the bacon. Uh, I just didn't get a really good feel for it. Uh, I wish I had the room in my stomach to eat more, but I, I just don't, it's, it's not enjoyable whatsoever. The Whopper, again, is one of my favorite burgers, one of my favorite fast food burgers of all time. So Burger King, you're still up there for having an amazing burger called the Whopper. But when it comes to this, oh, I don't, I, I, maybe, maybe take away a patty. Maybe it doesn't have, maybe because it's so big, maybe put it on the smaller thing with, the, with a runny egg on it and the bacon. And definitely take that sauce off. Didn't like that at all. Look how much sauce is on there. Even though there's that much sauce, it tasted dry. But again, I don't think I got that far into it. On my rating scale, I'm gonna have to give the Farmhouse King a would not recommend i did not like it at all maybe i would not recommend to an indifferent there are people that might like this i honestly don't think i know anybody that would like that uh again if we could just make it on a smaller scale with a runny egg and maybe less beef on it too 
it might actually go up to a would recommend to a quote and get it now. That's my recommendation from me to Burger King and from me to you guys. If this is the first time you stopped by my channel and you enjoyed watching this video and you don't wanna miss the next one, hit that subscribe button right here and click the notification bell. But if you want to show your support for this particular video, give it a thumbs up, ding, 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 and we'll see you next time on another Kendomic food review. Kendomic out. Boop. All right, guys, thanks for watching. Talk to you later, bye.